you guys welcome back to my channel today I decided to do something fun so I thought that I'm gonna do the blind makeup challenge now it's gonna be even more fun because today I'm not wearing contacts so I'm gonna take off these glasses and full on disclaimer that I'm not that great at doing makeup I actually don't really know what I'm doing so it's gonna be even more fun <laughs> you guys are gonna see me struggle a little bit really I think I'm gonna title this your only struggles at doing things or something or maybe I'll create like a playlist that's like my of my struggles and we could make this like a whole series and make it super fun but i'm going to attempt to do my makeup today and i hope you guys enjoy watching so i'm gonna go ahead and take off my glasses so that i'm completely blind and also i can't see anything so there's no mirrors around here or anything so yeah so my glasses off i'm gonna place them behind me on this table that i have right here and i'm gonna go ahead and get my little makeup pouch I got this at Forever 21 you guys super cute I got this years ago I actually need a bigger one because I can't fit my stuff in here anymore but I'm gonna go ahead and start so I'm going to be using my Studio Fix MAC foundation and it's in the color NC37 if you guys wanted to know I mean, I'm sure you guys don't care but you know placing that on the side getting my foundation out I've had this foundation for a while, hence why the cover looks super gross. And I'm going to go ahead and start doing my foundation with my Kabuki brush. And I can't remember if I got this Kabuki brush at MAC or at Sephora. And it doesn't say it on here, so I'm not sure, but I got it. I got it either at MAC or Sephora. And I got it a couple years ago, so it's actually pretty old. But it works. So I'm going to go ahead and start with my foundation. And uh, okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to dab it all over my face. And see what happens. I'm actually like pretty bad at makeup. Like I mean I could do it-ish, kind of. But it never goes well. So I'm going to start blending with my Kabuki brush. And pray that I'm doing something. <laughs> and that it's working. I don't know if any of you guys are as blind as I am. But like seriously I can't see anything. Like my vision is so bad. I'm pretty sure. I think it was like negative 5.50 or something. I think that's my glasses. Um prescription from the prescription I have for my glasses like I'm blind as a bat I can barely like I, I can see my hands right now but like if I go further it gets blurry because I have myopia so this should be interesting I don't know what I'm doing I just keep blending I'm gonna try to blend this down to my neck I don't know if I put enough I don't know if it's patchy who knows but I think that's gonna be the fun of it Actually, I, I really, like, I'm going to try my best to do it well, but I really hope I end up looking, like, super weird at the end, because that'll just be funny. That would be hilarious, you guys. I guess I'm done with foundation. I don't know. Maybe I should go a little bit more. Let me do a little more, just because, you know, I have a feeling. I have a feeling. <laughs> it's not enough. Let me do it by my nose under my eyes because you know a girl hasn't been sleeping have some real bad eyes or under eye circles you know and I try to go on circular motions because I I've seen before that that's what you're supposed to do but I don't know okay I think that's good enough that's good enough so, sorry if I keep leaning forward, it's just because I have my um, camera prepped up on a little table here. So, I'm just using the table to put, like, my leftov leftover stuff, like, whatever I'm, like, currently, like, holding on my hands. So, maybe I should use my side table so I'm not, like, coming at you guys all crazy every single time. Okay, next, I'm going to do my contour. I'm going to be using 
this 23 eyeshadow and blush palette it is by bh cosmetics you guys see here this was a gift actually by one of my family members i really love the colors in this they're super pretty i haven't used it that much but whenever i do like the colors are vibrant and pretty so i'm gonna take these out the only thing about this that i will say that i don't i don't like that much is that it does have a little bit of fallout so i mean but if you guys are like me and not like super super like into doing your makeup every day then this is not a bad investment like i mean it's not even an investment it's pretty cheap i'm pretty sure so Ugh, i have hair on my mouth <laughs> for my brush my old kabuki brush that is starting to fall apart but i still use it because well so i'm gonna show you guys the colors aren't these colors gorgeous <laughs> Okay guys, we're back and I'm going to continue on with contour. So I'm going to use my contour kit. This is the Master Contour by Face Studio. And I use this all the time. As you can see, I especially use the highlighter. I love it. It's super cute. It gives you like a nice golden shimmer. So I'm going to use this contour kit. I'm going to go ahead and do my contour, my blush, and my highlighter. So, I'm gonna go ahead and take this blush. Now, I do have to say that because I don't do my makeup often, I haven't actually invested in like a brush kit. So, I'm gonna tell you guys how to hack yourself, like your life. I'm gonna tell you a good life hack. So, like, if you don't have a contour brush, which I don't, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take any random brush that you have. I'm sure this much. I'm gonna take a smaller brush. I have these two. These are this one is from Bare Minerals and this one is also from Bare Minerals. Ah, Bare Minerals. What's wrong with me? I don't know why I can't speak today. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take a random brush, and you're gonna hold it like this, you're gonna almost flatten it out. That's what I do in my life, okay? And then you're gonna, you know, apply a generous amount of contour on there. And then you're gonna feel well now I have to feel it out, but if you have a mirror, you can really see what you're doing and you're gonna draw, you know, what everybody knows, the basic three. Sorry, my brother's laughing like a lunatic in the background. I think he thinks it's funny, but anyway. So, you're gonna draw a three on your face. Like, you know, like everybody knows, people everybody knows, but anyway. So, because I can't see, I'm gonna go ahead and fill it out. Um, trying here. <laughs> okay, in the title, funny, that's even better. Like, like, I'm really trying to find out my brush, I'm trying to feel it. I'm making a duck face. So again, bringing it down. Now, if you are like a heavier girl like me, and you're like, oh, my makeup doesn't look good, like, have a double chin, which I definitely do, tip, take some contour, and you're gonna contour underneath your chin. Now, I learned this from Adrian Bailon, because I sometimes watch the reel, I don't know if you check out their show, it's really good, but sometimes I watch their um, like clips that they post on YouTube, and Adrienne once said that she does in it, and I've been doing it ever since, and literally, life changer. So you're gonna take this contour, and you're gonna contour underneath your chin, and what that does is create a shadow so that, you know, you can't see your double chin as much. So actually, I totally recommend doing this. I do this every time I do my makeup now. So Adrienne, <laughs> not that she'll ever be watching this, but anyway. Thanks for the tip, sis. Like, seriously. Okay. So, other side. Same concept. Now, if you have a small forehead, I don't recommend you connect your um, contour at the top. But for me, I have a small forehead, so I want to give... I mean, I don't have a small forehead, so I want to give the illusion of, like, a smaller forehead-ish. Because I have a pretty big forehead. Um... So what I'm gonna connect my contour at the top, cause like you know, 
we're trying to cute ish as much as possible <laughs> so same concept I'm gonna draw the three I don't know why I'm explaining to you guys like I'm some kind of beauty girl like I I can barely do this you know I can barely do this I'm sure I look crazy right now okay so I I mean since I can't see it I think that that's our contour for today so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the blush now you could also do bronzer but I don't feel like doing bronzer most of the time like I think it makes me look too like I don't know anyway but you could do it if you like it but sometimes I feel like bronzer sometimes I feel like not so now I'm gonna do blush I'm gonna skip bronzer and same thing I'm gonna feel out my cheek and I'm just gonna go in circular motions and I'm gonna bring it up to my temple so that it's not just concentrated in one area okay now I'm gonna do the other side and this is such a pretty like light blush I recommend this blush in this um, kit like just for like the everyday use like if you do your makeup every day this is really good like cute pretty subtle blush I feel like maybe I should like keep doing this to blend it out a little bit okay now that we're done with that we are going to use we're going to do our highlight now I love my highlighter but I this it, this kit comes with this little brush but I mean I don't use it I use the same <laughs> the same brush that I use for my contour I'm gonna just like wipe it down I don't know like I said I don't have brushes and I'm gonna take some of this now this is a struggle for me because like I said I use most of it so I'm just gonna take this and I'm gonna do the same thing I did before I'm gonna fill it out okay now I believe your blush is supposed to go here like that's where I've seen most people wear it so that's where I put it usually I mean your blush your highlight oh my gosh now, I love this I love highlight highlighter some on my forehead pray that it works some on my nose again squeezing my brush because we don't have brushes that's what we do when we are you know or we're not the best at makeup and just trying to survive in life here. Okay. And okay. So I'm on my cupid's bow ish in some of my chin. That should be good. Or I look like a clown. Either or. So I'm gonna put that here on the side. And okay, so now we're gonna begin with our eyeshadow I was looking for it for a second I didn't really I don't remember where I put it my palette okay so back to the BH cosmetics palette we are going to use mm, let me see what color am I gonna use I think just to be safe since I can't see I'm going to start with this brown right here it's a really pretty color and I'm gonna put that on my lid. So, brown on my lid. Okay, this is the brush I came in, so that's the one I'm using. Okay, so, again, this brown. Just gonna take some. I'm gonna apply on my lid. And just pray that things are happening. And it's funny, you guys, because I'm actually going to record some more videos today. Like, I'm going to do um, a back-to-school shopping haul. And I think, like, when I finish this look, whatever it looks like, I'm going to use this same look and just film the other videos with. 
So I'm probably gonna end up looking crazy. So, I mean, at least I'll get a good laugh, right? I mean, I don't know. I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay. Feeling it out. Like, I mean, like, I feel like that should be okay, right? I mean, maybe let me go back and forth. Like, I don't know. Probably look crazy, but hey. At least your girl's trying. Okay, so what color do I feel like next? Let's see. I'm really feeling this shimmery color on top. Like, right here. So this is what I'm gonna use next. I'm gonna take some. You see what I mean? Like, it's such a pretty palette, but it has such... Like, it has fallout. I don't know. Or maybe it's just me. Because I do have aggressive hands. So, like, maybe I'm just pressing on it too much. So I'm doing that on my top lid. Or whatever. I don't really know the terminology, you guys. This is just a girl struggling. A girl struggling to live the normal life of a girl on a daily basis. Okay. Like, I feel like that shouldn't be too bad. I mean, I am doing the normal motions that I usually do, so like, okay. Other eye. Oh, okay. No, you know what would be funny? Like, maybe I should get my brother to do my makeup one day. If you guys want that, maybe I could convince him to do it. Oh! It would be look at him in the background. I think he's objecting. Because that might be funny, like... Him doing it and seeing, like, how it turns out. Sorry for the street noise. There's a car passing by, and I guess maybe they have a flat tire. I'm not sure. It's a weird sound. Okay, I think that's good. Next color, let's see. Should we have a pop of color? Should I go bold? I'm not nervous to go bold though, I'm not gonna lie. Mm, let me see. Should I go bold? Mm, 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 I don't know what this looks like, like, maybe like the inside of tuna macro kind of color. Something bold. You guys see that? Yeah, I'm going to go with that bold color. And where am I going to put it? I think I'm going to put it in my, like, in my lower lid. But I'm going to bring it up a little bit. Like, should I come closer? I'm not sure if you guys could see what I'm doing or not. But let's just try this. I don't know. Never done this before. Like, I'm just bringing it down, you see? And then I'm going to bring it up. And I think I'm going to do that for the... Maybe I should just, like, this close to the camera so you guys could see what I'm doing. But... I mean, I don't know, it might look completely like a mess. So I'm gonna do the same for the other eye. And you never know, like maybe taking bold moves is what we need to do, sisters. And men, guys too. This is a open space for everyone. Okay. Like I'm proud, I'm sure I look like a straight up clown, like, I don't know. Okay. <coughs> like, should I stop there? Should I keep going? Like, I don't know. Okay. 
we're taking bold moves. We are doing it today. Okay, I'm gonna stop because like I really can't see. So, and should we go? Should we go with the out like a darker? Should we go darker on the outside? I don't know. Looking at this palette, but I really I'm nervous. But I was, you know what? No, we're gonna make money moves. <laughs> like Cordy says, I'm gonna use this darker brown right here this one and I'm gonna put it on my on the outside gotta make like a V shape on the outside let's see probably look crazy I don't know Cause like why not why not do it why not go big you know I mean, if we're gonna look crazy anyway, or if it's gonna be a challenge anyway, I might as well, like, you know, go big. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm probably, like, the most unfemale like female, like, well, not the most, but I feel like this, like, basic girl 101, like, how do we feminine 101? I can't do my own makeup. Like, girls do their makeup in the car and stuff like that. I don't know how they do that. Like, it takes me hours to just do basic, like, neutral-looking makeup that, you know, that, like, a 12-year-old could do nowadays. But, you know, we are, you know, we're trying here. I mean... Okay, I think that's good. Maybe we'll level up the shimmer. Okay, one last step for eyeshadow. Cause I'm like, we might as well just go there. I'm gonna use the shimmery. What color is this? It's like a, like a darker gold color. That's what I'm gonna use. I'm gonna put that in the middle. Okay. Cause like why not, right? Other eye. And maybe even like a little bit in the center. With the eyeballs. We're just doing stuff today. Okay, I think I'm done with this. We're gonna move on from this because it's not, God knows. I might end up like looking like a literal clown. So, next we're gonna move on to, mm, what should we do next? Let me see. Now I have misplaced, totally misplaced my concealer. So instead, hack, we're gonna life hack it out gonna use a little more of this um foundation and we're gonna try attempt to clean up our mess that I'm sure I've made I'm sure with all the, between the fallout and just the messy strokes and everything I have stuff so I'm gonna use this basically as concealer I'm gonna put it under my eye like this I'm just gonna use my finger cuz whatever and I'm gonna, I'm gonna attempt to clean some stuff up off my cheek. Okay, that's, ooh, yeah, look at my finger. I don't know what it is, but I definitely had stuff under my eye. Okay, same with this side. We're gonna need a little bit more from concealer, you know? We're just life hacking it. We're life hacking it, and we're just gonna do it, okay? We're just gonna do it. We are boss boss women and men ladies and gentlemen we're just gonna do it okay nothing can stop us 
when an obstacle like a lost concealer comes your way you figure it out you know hood style hood style just figure it out come up with ideas there we go that's all Hashtag perseverings, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't know why I can't speak today. I'm like, I don't know. Something's wrong. Okay. Now we're going to use this HD powder. It's LA Girls Pro Powder. I've had this for a while. I actually, fun fact, you guys. I actually bought this the day of my prom because, um, the girls who were doing my makeup, like, they were like, you should get some HD powder, you know? Really give it a good finish, so I just bought this the day of my prom, so I had this. I've had this for a while. Oof! We're gonna take this brush, and we're going to dip it in some of the powder, this trans HD powder, and we're going to kind of like baking, but not really. <laughs> really, I'm just trying to fix my mistakes, you guys. Uh, I'm just trying to fix whatever mistakes I'm sure I've made. <laughs> so we're gonna just go out under our eyes. Because again, we don't have concealer, so we're hoping this will fix it ish. Okay. Now that that's done, we're gonna go on to my most feared thing of the day. Mascara. Mascara. How am I going to do this? I'm blind. I don't know. This is... Flirt Far Out Length Stre Strengthening Mascara. I don't know. I guess this is it. This little bottle. I actually like this mascara because I like the applicator. It's like tiny. You guys see? It gets super tiny. And it's easy to use, I don't know. But okay, I'm gonna try to feel out my eyes. Like, am I actually doing something? I don't know. I really hope, like, you know how sometimes when you're doing your mascara, you the, the applicator or your eyelashes touch your lid or something and you end up like ruining your shadow? That's super annoying. I hope that doesn't happen. But at the same time, at this moment, I guess anything goes. Okay. So I don't my lower lid now. Oh my gosh. I'm so terrified. I'm terrified. I can't see. Yeah, that's definitely not going to go well. Okay. I know that. Oh, I can feel it on my cheek already. It, my lash definitely stuck to my cheek. Okay, next eye. Okay, lower lash. Oh. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay. Do I look pretty? <laughs> Do I look pretty? I don't know. Okay, next, I have my this lip gloss. Lip, not lip gloss. Oh. It's a lipstick. It's a liquid lipstick. Just says lips on it, and it's in the color fifth. Oh no, zero five Persian plum. And I don't even think if I used this. I don't know if I've used this lipstick before or not. Like I, I've taken it all packaged out of the package and I looked at it, but and that was not coming out. Okay, please come out. Oof. 
that'll either be great or very bad yeah I, I haven't used those lipstick I usually like to go for more neutral colors so it's gonna be interesting it's gonna be interesting okay look at that honestly it's really pretty on the packaging though okay and like I said I'm blind so who knows let's just do it uh, just feeling on my lips That should have been the bottom lip, not the top. Uh. Like I said, this is either going amazing, or I, or I look like I, I need help. <laughs> oh, I think I just got on my teeth. Okay, now nah, that should be good, right? I mean, come on. I know my own lips. I'm confident. Come on, I'm confident. You're, you did great. Positive reinforcements. Okay, guys, this is the final look. I don't know what I'm look <laughs> what I look like. I'm gonna have a reveal moment in a second. So yeah. Let's see. I can't see because I don't have my glasses on. <laughs> Do I look pretty? <laughs> These are this is the shadow, everything, the full look. <laughs> Let me get my glasses back on. So I can see myself on the screen let's see oh okay glasses are on i'm too far away from the screen i can't see anything still because i'm blind so let's get closer closer wait you guys i mean it's not cute but like i didn't do half bad like, I don't know if it's just me, or maybe it's because I can't... Let me see, because my glasses are on. Wait, let me zoom in. You guys. I kind of slayed. Like, maybe, I don't know. Maybe it's because the way it's coming off of my, my camera. But, like, I'm not mad at it. Hey. We, we're slaying. We're here slaying girls, guys, everyone. And I actually kind of like this color. I never wore this color before. I've had it for a while. But I never wore it. I think I was too intimidated by the way that it looked on the bottle. Um, I don't know. I'm kind of living for it. I mean, obviously, I have to clean it up. And obviously, my shadow's not good. But, like... If it was somebody like on the street, like just like a random everyday person, like who didn't know how to do makeup, like I think my glasses really do a good job of hiding it though. Because I honestly like it's a mess, but like honestly, people have gone aside and looked worse. <laughs> people have gone aside and looked worse. So that's it for the video you guys thank you guys so much for watching um i make videos every tuesday wednesdays and friday so if you guys want to come back and check out my other videos out we are welcome to this is my first video so i'm really hopeful that people will watch it if anybody even like finds it if you guys want to watch it and subscribe like and subscribe in the comments and leave comments down below and i'll be sure to read all your comments and if you guys have any suggestions anything you want to see from me also leave it in the comments below i'll be super glad do anything you guys want so this is it for me here i'm trying to make videos giving positive vibes to everyone of all sizes shapes you know ethnicities races whatever see you guys next time bye